All right, so like I was just thinking, you know, like <laughs> I know that you know that I have we took in the border because it's part of the beers without borders or borders without beers or something. But you know, other day I came in the living room, mother motherfucker had I guess he had a big old Saturday night because it came in and, and his friend was there uh, wearing nothing but a white t-shirt. His friend, a dude, his friend, a dude was there and wearing nothing but a white t-shirt. It's covered in goddamn blood. I don't know where the motherfucker is there. But dead. his cock was hanging out. Well, he's dead. That's all he's wearing is a white t-shirt covered in blood. And, you know, I worry the motherfucker's dead. And I get a text message from my roommate. He says he's in the hospital because the dude has done torn his foreskin. <laughs> oh, man. And I'm like, what are you talking about? Man. He tore your foreskin. He came in there, apparently picked up some dude in the night. And they got all hot and heavy. Didn't have no condoms. Didn't have no lube or nothing. Dude's like, just fuck me. <laughs> Put it in there. Rip the foreskin. It looks like a goddamn massacre took place in the living ah. room. Blood everywhere. Blood all over. Some dude I don't know is laying there dead. As far as I'm concerned, he woke up snoring and shit. Man, that is some messed up consequences <laughs> right there. You can't get that shit on pay per view. No, no. Why you trying to mess with me? You can't test with me. You can't tussle because you know it's the best of me. Coming from the booth, then it's coming straight to you. And you know it's coming straight after you. Man, fuck a gun. I'd rather go one on one and make you try.